Dreamland. It's about no. to jam out. Is it Onet? Are we going Onet? Yoshi. No, we're going Yoshi's. <laughs> People call this Marth story, but a lot of Falcos like this stage too. Get oh, those yeah. early forward smash kills off the side. Uh, you can really combo people around this stage pretty easily as well. Yeah, it's yeah, uh, pretty good. Or it's easy to apply pressure, I think, on this map. You know? One of the most fun things with spaces on this map is that your up tilt can hit on the low platforms as long as you're towards the center of them. That's cool. So I did not know that. Yeah, Falco, to, Falcos uh, like that a lot. I'm gonna have to use that. Who goes for that wave dash back? Forward smash doesn't work out though. Yeah, white Marth is definitely my favorite color of Marth. I white or black. Like it very much. Uh, I used to play White Marth, but I believe it's cursed, so. <laughs> oh, I like that air dodge recovery. Very good. Doesn't let Falco try to abuse his down air. Oh, the up smash connects. Not quite spacing that, fair, or that forward smash. Damn. Nice. That covers both options right boom, there. You try to boom, go low, boom. Marth Peeler gets you. Yep. Try to go high, and the uh, ledge hop back air will get you. Oh, the pressure. Uh. Wow. Oh, another <laughs> up smash. That's probably an accident. I believe both of them were probably accidents. Ouch, oh, wave dash back. Tipper. <laughs> I love that noise. When it connects, it's just yeah. like... Oh, so perfect. Falco's brain just got split in two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Instant. And... Oh, okay. Good patience by Tink. Oh, oh wow. Just charging that Yeah, smash. he got his invincibility and just like... Oh, nice. Good lasers to forward smash right there. Yeah, he abused invincibility to get through that forward smash. Yeah. Refreshed it and then wave dashed up immediately. Yeah, I, I've seen Hindog throw those out, a, uh, those charged up side smashes a couple yeah. times. Uh -huh. At least once or twice a game, I It's a pretty like. good edge guard option. Oh, yeah. Like, if you just, like, wave dash back and do it, people will often... Ooh, okay. No follow-up out of that downer, though. I would like to see an up air. Wow, Hindog's pressure is on Ooh. point right now. He's Ooh. barely making any tech players. Ouch. Oh, oh, down air doesn't make the forward so smash. Close. I thought he was going to go for the back air. Ooh. Nice. Done. Tink really taking advantage of that side B clip right yeah. there. Gets the reverse nair out of it. Very good for him. Absolutely. We're at two stocks apiece, and this is a volatile and matchup, too. Death. Never mind. Full stock lead. <laughs> All right. Still a volatile matchup. Ooh, okay. I don't know if he was trying to, like, wave land grab or something right there. He was a little late on it, so he backed out. Goes for the hard read on the forward smash instead of waiting it out. Trying to close that stock out early. Very safe of Hindog to just like tech in. And he is not missing anything right now. Oh. This pressure is insane. Hindog is on fire right now. Yeah. Tink trying to bait those platform drops. Oh, oh Randall. Come on, Randy. Oh, man. What are you doing down there? That fair right there. Gets grabbed Ouch. for his trouble. And then the walkaway forward smash, 2004. Oh. Oh, goes for the upper, doesn't quite get it. Did not land on the platform in time to uh, it, challenge He does that have his jump, okay. Oh. Yeah, even if, okay. uh, I think even if Hindog hadn't held ledge right there, that, that air dodge wouldn't have grabbed. Yeah, I, think it was I don't, a I don't think low. so either. Yeah. All right, Hindog looking good. That pressure on the bottom was so tight. Airtight. <laughs> Airtight. The frames to, like, shield grab, or, like, hey, shield, it, you probably can't even shield grab. Yeah, so no. It was so good. Not messing up his tech Ouch. at all. I wonder what he's listening to in those headphones right now. Yeah, really. What classical music. <laughs> Bobbing his head to classical. Mozart. Yeah. Tchaikovsky. Something like that. Yeah. Wagner. That pressure looked know. like a symphony, man. Maybe Taylor Swift. Who yeah. knows? <laughs> Kelly Clarkson. I can go down the list. Hey, oh, okay. Don't be hating on Kelly Clarkson. Oh, no, I She's love it. She's the greatest pop star of the last. Hey, yeah, America I can't say that with a straight face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more of a Ruben Stutter type of guy. <laughs> oh, there we go. Tink with the character change. So it's a spacey battle now. This is going to be interesting uh, because we're on Battlefield. Falco's like Battlefield a lot, too. Platforms also on this stage allow for pretty good combos. Ooh! Ouch. Oh, up smash doesn't kill. Man, maybe. Wow. I, I think Tink just needed that speed, honestly. He's, yeah, he's going crazy that could fast be it. right now. You know, honestly, it looked like that his spacing was just a little... A little off in that last set. Oh, yeah. you know what? He could, I think he could have just held ledge right there. I don't think Falco could have got the back. Still gets the crouch cancel down smash, though. Very nice. Tink taking first stock pretty easily. Oh, oh interesting. Funny. Probably an error. Another nice power shield. Yeah, because uh, it wasn't like Tink's movement was bad last game. It was pretty good. He didn't make too many movement errors. Oh, he tried to cover that high, high. Uh, what do you call it, illusion option, but not quite. Oh, nice just short. Barely. Yeah, but his spacing was off. He missed a bunch of forward smashes. You know. So Fox will probably suit him better. 
Dash attack leads to up smash. That won't kill, oh. though. It's got probably about another 20% before that will kill. Just short on that bear. Almost had a, had yeah. a stock right there. Oh, oh wow. Stared fire I thought he was going to, like, jab face. out of that. Yeah. Hindog not really able to gain any traction. Nice back right of shield right there. His uh, Tink's movement has been really good, you know, using the platforms to try to escape from any laser pressure. Nice forward smash. I think he can get back from that. Oh. He does. Yeah, nice. And as a result, Hindog's really just been at uh, Fox's mercy, you know. Falco's definitely got a lot more trouble when his lasers aren't connecting, when somebody knows how to move around him. Hindog does take his first stock of the match, though. Uh, only 48% taken on that stock, too, so it could go... The momentum could switch in a heartbeat. Nice charged uh, up smash, spacing right around that get up attack. I haven't seen a lot of punishing on the side Bs from Tink. That's true, from both of them. They've yeah. both been getting hit by the side Bs a lot, yeah, too. Yeah, I mean, Even when they see, read them. Yeah, and there like, we go. There's an uppy that doesn't get yeah, punished. Yeah, the edge guards in these games. The edge guarding has been suboptimal, sub to say the least. I feel like whoever just starts edge guarding first is going to get this, because it's been just like. Three or four misses on each stock. Yeah, for sure. Know? And that's why the momentum switched so quickly. Yep. Somebody just starts getting good reads on the edge and executing. Okay, nice snare. Let's see. Oh, oh see, he, he was thinking about it right there. He, yep. But if he goes down right there, he they, might have gotten clipped by it, and then yeah. he's dead. Scary. Because Falco's illusion knocks you down. Oh. Oh, that oh boy. Oh, he does get back to the ledge. Ooh, oh, nice Very lasers. close to being uh, yeah. dirty. And that, the down air right there to cover Illusion, that's yeah. so tight. Like, like if you that. mess it up. Oh, man. Illusion trades with back air. That was so close. Uh, uh, is he he's too dead. low? Oh, wow. wow good, good trade. Coverage. Good trade. Yeah, that was a great trade. All right, Tink. Three stocks him on that one. Yeah. Not bad. I wonder what the counter pick will be. I feel like he can't go to FD, which is what Falco kind of likes against Fox because, you know, no platformers to move around on. He goes to uh, FD, I think. Well, yeah, Maybe. he goes to FT, Tinkle just go mark. Yeah, I don't know. Dreamland, I guess. It is Dreamland, and with no character switch, so it is Fox, uh, Falco. And oh, the oh, shine! be quick. Oh, is he too low? Nope. He does get back. Okay, good. That was a good trade for Hindog. If he didn't trade on that upbeat, Tink could have just stayed in position, taken ledge, and that would have been it. Nice, good space back oh. here. Oh, he keeps charging those up smashes. Hindog with the frame of mind to just like space his illusion just above it. Yeah. Yeah, Muti King told me to aim all side Bs at the person's head. Really? Always. Yeah. Smart. That's in space, he did those or just in general? Just in general. He said, just aim it at their head. And I said, I think okay. against Marth, uh, <laughs> his jab will still cover that. Oh, up smash. No, we're on Dreamland. It's not going to kill. It's going to take a little bit longer before up smash is going to kill him. Oh, okay, finally connects on a side B. Reverses it, but it's still enough for the stock. So we're three stocks apiece now. Ooh, goes for that falling up air. I like that. As soon as he L canceled an up smash right there. Yeah. That's pretty safe, because if he tries to turn around and do it. Interesting choice by Hindog to spot dodge the uh, up falling up air, too. Oh, the raw up smash. He just ran right into it. Doesn't get the coverage again on this, the illusion. It's tough to cover them, though. I mean, they're really fast moves. Another time, that's right. Like M2K said, go for the head. Yep. It was right above that forward smash. And Tink tried to get the shine out of shields. Didn't quite get it, though. I like that side B to just get out of there completely rather than just kind of yeah, like sit there yeah, and try exactly. and wiggle out. It basically resets neutral. Yeah, exactly. The other person can't get there in time to cover it. Yeah, I mean, especially because Falco is full of pressure. You really don't want to be stuck in that situation. Yeah. Hindog's been having a lot of trouble with get-up attacks, too. Tink's been doing them a lot, and uh, Hindog really is trying to get in there and keep the pressure on. Wow, Tink taking a huge lead on this stock. 75% already. Oh, see, there's another get-up attack. He's just not yeah. quite spacing it right. I mean, that was 182% on that Fox yeah. when he died. That's, that's way too high. Forward smash, a bit of an overkill on that one. Okay, let's see if Hindog can get something going right here. Oh, bad. man. All bad right. DI in that back air. I don't think any kind of DI would save him, but it was still pretty bad. He went really deep. This is where Hindog needs to uh, make a play. Oh, get up attack again. Wow, Hindog having so much trouble with that. Oh, oh. oh drops his pressure. Didn't, missed a wave dash there. 
or I uh, shine cancel. Oh, okay. This could be. This could be it. Get the, oh wow! Oh. Nice angle by Tink. Oh, mm, misses the space. Just barely off on that bear. Okay, I like that use of lasers there, trying to get him out of the illusion. <laughs> barely off. Tink very smart to go high. Man, there we time. go. Finally, spaces around a get up attack. Very nice. I feel like the last three times Hit Dogs had him on the on the platform. Same thing. He just runs very bare yeah. every time. Yep. And Hit Dog bringing it back. Only 50%. Oh, he's off stage. Okay, get sledge. Nice shine on shield by Tink. Okay. Not letting him get back to center and stage. Be... Goes high. Okay, that's good. He's back. He's back. Yep. Tink's and... still just controlling space. He might be too far. Oh, that's, that's, game. that's it. That's game. Good job by Tink closing that out. Good game. Not letting the uh, the comeback get to his head. Yeah. And a good 2-1 comeback by Tink after dropping the first game. Nice. Two stocked on the first game too, I believe, right? Ooh. Ooh.